Then... Oh, oh Mage, you can't be serious. serious. I, I am. We, we are, are not doing, doing that. that. Why, Why not? not? Because... Come, Come on, Krista. Krista. What's, What's wrong, wrong with Omid? We're, We're not, not calling our baby Omid. One, One of you is enough. enough. Clementine, a little help here. Omid the second. No. Omid Jr.? No. What if it's a girl? Then we name her Krista. But I'm Krista. I don't want to call her Krista. That's just confusing. So name her Genevieve. I don't care. How can you not care? You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously. Especially the Lomi's future. Keep talking. You'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend. Why don't you, uh, uh, get cleaned up at the girls' room, plan? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. Hello? Assurez-vous que la salle de bain est sûre. How gross. I see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Come on out now. What are you doing? 
Get out here. You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. I ain't gonna ask again. No, that's all I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? I'm serious, what else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me, I'll pop you. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around, come on. Please stop. Give me that hat. No. Where'd you get it? I asked you a question. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. Krista, talk to me. <sighs> this will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn. Or smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. What else can we do? Find something that'll burn, maybe. I don't know. Won't be easy in the dark and in the rain. You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... Omid said that- I know what Omid said. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet. Then ice. Then snow. It won't be easy. Is it safe there? Safer than here because of the cold. Or so they say. We just need to keep moving north. I 
I miss Lee? I'm sure you do. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit. That's still not enough. The flames are too low. And this won't burn. This might burn. You think you're fooling her? Give us the truth and you don't get hurt. You fucking with me? Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. He's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. <laughs> what the Krista, fuck? Run! Hey!
Krista, are you there? Hey boy, it's okay. <coughs> Sam. Well, nice to meet you, Sam. Looks pretty run over, but you never know. Let's look around for some food. Gotta check everywhere.
Nothing left here. <sighs> Empty. Better keep looking, huh, Sam? Not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. Hey, wanna play? Wanna play catch? been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Maybe we'd better not wait around to find out. Hmm, nothing edible. Looks like they were a happy family once. Sam? Thank mm -hmm. you. 
stay out of their reach. Please don't be bad. I guess you are pretty hungry too. Here you go. Hey, you don't need it all. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on, kid. We gotta get him. I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah we're, we're good. good. Hey, hey, you all right? I, I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Well, I'm Luke, and this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. It's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. And okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- OH SHIT! What? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog! I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. I can't remember the last time I saw a dog. No, no, just look at it, please. <laughs> yeah, and have you sink your teeth into Pete's neck? No way. My neck? Why am I the one? Because I don't know a dog bite from a mosquito bite from a lurker bite, man. It's not. Watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's been here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. Now what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I, I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... You don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at Alright, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Ah, oh, shit! And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Don't bite my ass. 
I'm not working. <gasps> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Oh, whoa, what the you fuck? You idiot. Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I'm not, I'm not working for anyone. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. I just need help. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't, don't act, act like, like we're the, the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. It's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take your arm off. <gasps> I know, I know that worked work for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We can try that. It won't do any good. You'll, You'll just be, be making it worse for the girl. girl. It's crazy. No, no one's going to volunteer to do that. I would, if it'd be to save her life. Then what? How would we know it worked? Just let Carlos have a look. I'm on your side, kid. No need for a guilt trip. Who's she? Sarah, what they say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? To find my friend Krista. Forget it. Won't get five feet. Look, I may be in the minority here, but my gut tells me she's telling the truth. It probably is just a dog bite. Probably. So, what do you think? Was it a murder? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever is set in, we'll know if she's going to turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. We have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, please. But, yeah, we can't do that. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Always got his mom's temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shit. It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, safer for who? I can't believe this. You're gonna be fine, you're gonna be fine.
much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. stitches.
house meeting in five minutes. That's, that's good. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Fine. Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. medical supplies around here somewhere. from getting infected. Damn it. Just 
just need to have this baby. Let it be okay and let it be his. Hi, can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Help me and I won't tell him. I, I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. your medical supplies. Yeah, it is. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca's okay, but she's old. And that's it. Yes, we are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. I promise. Me too. Friends. A pinky swears forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. safer to do this.
gonna suck.
Are you happy? I could have died, you know. Well, you did it. I just needed some help. You packed yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. I did. I took stuff, and I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start her. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So just save it. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Man, look at sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, but there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Better than losing it. I hate to say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stones. Definitely. Hey, look, I just want to say I'm sorry for, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... We had a bad experience once. What happened? Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. Bad things have happened to everyone. So, 
since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. If you'd let yourself heal up, take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them. But they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He's the reason I keep my hair short. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone, but he saved me first, lots of times. Well, it sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah, he was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your wings while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? You're still here. I wouldn't be comfortable if I were you. Luke invited me to stay. Good for him, but that's not how things work around here. We make decisions as a group, and you're wearing out you one. You got what you came here for. Now go. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. What's her problem? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing could probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Really? No way. Hey! 
Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway. So, so I, I grab the gun, the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the, the gun, gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course the buck gets away. What are you going to tell her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal to you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even, Even if it, it means, means people you love hate you for it. He doesn't hate you. Nick's father wasn't there much, and he was a piece of shit when he was. So it fell to me to keep him in line, raise him right. Meant I couldn't just be nice Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete! Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. Your carver, what do you do? Who's carver? Check, Check those, those guys, guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest, and look for ammo. We're running low. Can I help? I got it. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. What's this doing here? Is he shot too? Yeah. These fellas got lit up something good.
There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky-dink pissant match. What was it then? Fubauer. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! Shouldn't we go get the others? Wish we could. But one of these folks might still be alive, and they just might be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You want to be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. It's what I'd do. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this outfit. Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. We shot the pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Do I know you? <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me! <coughs> Please.
are you gonna do? Someone's outside. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? Can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. 